But before we get to that, let's talk about some of the specifics or some of the options that you have if you're searching for a Magicycle deer. Starting out, price. The deer comes in at $24.99. There is one variation that comes in at about $50 less. We'll talk about that when we get to there. It's a high step bike. So the deer has two wheel size options. The 20 inches you see here, as well as a 26 wheel option for the step through frame. Now, the nice thing about the 20 inch wheels allows for a wider range of riders. So the step through with the 20 inch wheels, like you see here, has a listed height range of four foot 10, all the way up to six foot two. There's quite a bit of seat post room there. So you could definitely get up to that height and drop it down for shorter riders. Now the step through and the high step with the 26 inch optional wheels, have the same height ranges, which are five foot five riders up to six foot eight. There are some color options available. The color you see here in front of you is a space gray, which is kind of like a matte gray with some black accents. The other options that the 20 inch step through is offered in are gonna be a dawn yellow and a pearl white. That pearl white is gonna be exclusive to the 20 inch wheel step through frame. If you go with the non-step through or the high step, your color options are going to be that same dawn yellow and space gray like you see here, but as well as a neon green, which is a really bright, almost radioactive green, which I wish the 20 inch wheel was available in. Now, the only other option you're going to find is if you're looking at the high step model, it's going to be one of the bikes that's listed for $24.49. And what that bike is, is listed as the off-road bike. And that comes without the rear rack or fenders like you see here, but it does come with 26 inch wheels as the standard. They do not have a 20 inch wheel option, but for $50, you're not gonna be able to purchase the rack or fender. So we recommend if you're looking for an off-road versus the touring that these are listed as, just go ahead and get the touring model and then take the rack and fenders off. That additional $50 savings is not worth it, especially for the initial purchase. This is not the first Magicycle bike we have tried out. We rode the Cruiser and Cruiser Pro before, and we were pretty impressed by the 52 volt system on these bikes. So I'm really excited to put the 52 volt system on this bike to the test on our hills, especially considering that it has a little bit larger of a battery than what we've seen on some other Magicycle bikes. 